Hey guys, and welcome to another video. This one is going to be on a uh, reflect build and why it doesn't work. Do, do you see what I'm doing here? It's a mirror. It's a mirror, guys. It's a it's a mirror for the reflect build. God damn, am I funny? Anyways, let's get into this thing. Okay, so reflect is <clears throat> something that I've talked about many times before. But when I talk about it, I'm talking about reflect against you. Uh, this is something that I wanted to work on for a long time, which is a build where you reflect the damage to the enemies. Now, on paper, this looks pretty solid. Um, there are a lot of unique pieces of gear to help it work. There's some uh, authority modifiers and whatnot. Um, unfortunately, even with all of this, it does fall flat. Now, maybe I missed something. Maybe I did. Uh, but let's go through what I've got and what I used and my process and explain why using actual reflect doesn't work. Now, I am going to talk about later in the video uh, using a different way, not actually using reflect to reflect. You're using other things, um, but reflect itself, unfortunately, doesn't work. Uh, so let's break down why that is. Um as the cats have some kind of horrible cat battle over there. Okay, so starting here, um, you've got, again, quite a few pieces of gear uh, to work with. Now, you're going to notice if you're new to the game or newer to the game, you will notice I have some uniques that are legendary. Uh, you can't get these anymore. Uh, they're long gone, but it doesn't matter. It doesn't affect the build or anything in any way. Uh, so I'm using five uniques. Uh, these are all the uniques I could find that affect Reflect in any way. Um, there are a couple of different options for some of these, like the shield. Um, I have gone and picked what I feel like are the best ones. Uh, so starting with the Karma he Headwind Bone, um, it gives a pretty large amount of damage Reflect Amp, uh, up to 30%, and up to a thousand reflect or up no sorry up to 500 reflect damage um which sounds good right it, you're it sounds like a lot of numbers um but you have to remember that's so that's reflecting an enemy hits you and they get reflected 500 damage um i don't know if you look at the numbers on weapons and stuff but like you do more than that with very early on weapons like this weapon itself does so when I auto attack, I do more damage than I am reflecting. Now this is getting amped, okay? So that's not the direct number, but bear with me. Um, so the mirror wall shield uh, can do up to a thousand reflect damage and another five hundred for two seconds upon block. Um, I have gone out of my way to set up this build in a way that I am going to be blocking a lot because. Uh, obviously, if you're just going to be standing there taking damage, you want to be able to survive it. Um, block is a great way to do that. You can get your block rate up to 85%, I think. And that's 85% of the hits aren't going to hurt you. But while using this shield, it can reflect the damage upon blocking. Uh, so even though you aren't taking any damage, you still reflect it. Uh, so that's pretty good. Uh, the Karma Ancient Beings Helmet... Uh, gives you another, I think it's up to 25, up to 30% reflect damage amplification, which again, sounds really good on paper. Uh, I'm going to skip the shoulder for a second, come back to it. And then we've got the belt, okay, which just gives a little bit of reflect damage up to 350, which is still not very much. The rest of the stats on it are honestly pretty garbage. <clears throat> the shoulders are where you can get a reasonable amount of reflect damage uh, so it starts with uh, up to a thousand base reflect but then it gives an additional reflect damage up to 10% of your max health for four seconds when hit with a four second cooldown which means it's got permanent uptime as long as you're getting hit um, now if you get your hit points up really high like let's say you got up to 50,000 hit points okay which is a pretty pretty high amount you can go higher than that obviously um but 50,000 is a pretty 
pretty high end amount of hit points. Um, that means you're doing 5,000 reflect damage, which means this piece alone could do 6,000 reflect damage, which is so much more than all the others. Um, so something like the belt becomes completely useless with a piddly little 350, so you would end up dropping this belt. Um, the helmet would stay because of the reflect damage amp, the weapon would stay because it's got reflect damage amp, and the shield would stay because then you can reflect, reflect upon blocking. <coughs> You also do get that from the uh, Karma Headwind Boned Weapon, so you don't necessarily need the shield if you did want to replace it with something else. There are, uh, so if you wanted to put in Miraceti Sailboat, so you'd get the Earthquake effect, which would do more damage than this thing completely anyway, uh, which again is a problem we're going to get to. Uh, so that's the five uniques um, that I'm using. Uh, and again, when you add up all the totals, you don't end up with a lot of damage reflected. You really, really don't. Um, there are a few other places to get them, to get reflect stuff. I have scoured through every possible authority modifier on every piece of gear um, and checked them for craftable things off of those uh, modifiers. Uh, I don't think I have missed anything. Maybe I did, but even then, even if I missed one modifier, in the long run, you'll see this isn't going to be a viable build. Um, so on chest, you can get reflect damage and craft it into reflect damage amplification. Now you'll see I've got a bunch of hit point and stuff uh, because of this thing's hit point percent. Uh, so I wanted to just stack as many hit points as I can. Uh, the only other place I could find reflect damage in any uh, reasonable amount uh, is the gloves. Uh, you can get the, I think it's Cathsor has reflect damage that you can craft into reflect damage amp and keep the reflect damage, as well as, um, I don't know what the other one is, but you can get percentage reflect damage, which would obviously modify the actual base reflect damage. But that's it. That is every modifier I could possibly find uh, to work with Reflect at all. Uh, I went out of my way to check the Zodiac. Obviously, there is none. Uh, the only Reflects you will find are the making yourself immune to Reflect. There's four of those in the special, and then there's two in here that will work uh, and give you uh, Reflect damage taken decrease. They have nothing to do with Reflect. I went through every single one of the uh, relics, there is nothing that does anything with reflect in here. I went through core gems and soul gems. Uh, none of those have anything to do with reflect. In the long run, there is basically nothing else that can modify regular reflect. And without any knowledge on if reflect scales from any other modifiers, which I have done some very light testing. Um, I didn't find anything in terms of reflect. So now we're going to go with what I've got on. Okay. And we're just going to go to like a tier or act 13 area with just my pure reflex stuff on nothing else, no modifiers. And you can see, yes, the enemies die. Obviously I am staying alive. Um, and this is, I mean, it's not terrible for where we are, um, you know, and again, I haven't completely set up the character, uh, I haven't, like, gone out of my way to modify anything else to worry about getting more, more regen or anything else, um, and again, I'm gonna talk about other things people are going, well, why aren't you using this, this, and this, because this is purely reflect, this is just trying to see what reflect can do, uh, so you can see the enemies do die, uh, you know, they're, they're not invincible. They die reasonably quickly, uh, considering how bad the damage output is. Uh, so now the thing is, we'll go to Saludo here, and we're going to grab just a tier one white map and go try that. And you can see that suddenly the, the scale becomes really problematic really quickly. Uh, even if they were hitting you a lot, um, you don't end up with much here. <coughs> I apologize for the cough. I'm st <coughs> still <laughs> recovering. 
So here's a tier one uh, map at statue level 20. And you'll see that like, yeah, the enemies start to die eventually, but like even at a tier one, this is gonna take forever. Like this is, you'll, you'll never finish a map this way. Um, and that's with, again, every possible modifier I can get uh, to adjust the reflect um, with fairly high rolls on the other stuff. Uh, it's not like I was skimping out in the attempt. And you can see, again, the enemies are dying and I'm living, but this is not going to be viable. It's in, in the long run. Uh, so with that said, um, I am going to talk about what you could do if you wanted to try and do like a reflect build um, that would give make your life so much easier than trying to do this. Okay, so since I didn't show the uh, the the Zodiac for the reflect build, I thought I'd go back quickly and show uh, that there's basically nothing that's going to help reflect directly. What I ended up going with is basic stuff through here, basic stuff through here. You can't see cause the screen switched. Uh, basic through here, basic through here, uh, some damage dampening here, some more damage dampening in these two, uh, because there's nothing that you can do to get more damage. Um, I went with area of effect here. I didn't, I wanted to see if area of effect affected the distance that you can reflect, but reflect reflects no matter what, as far as I can tell, uh, nothing to do with range. Um, went into some shield stuff here down here I wanted to get more range just because I wasn't sure um, lightning damage because I wasn't sure if I would reflect and cause shock effect yeah I you don't um, I went into here so that I would have dodge disabled so that I wouldn't dodge attacks because we wanted to reflect and over here I mo mostly just went defensive <coughs> so there's nothing really good when it comes to reflect um, that can help it so what I've done here is thrown together very quickly uh, what would be a much better reflect build or if you were going to try to do reflect you could do this and and, and completely make reflect useless uh, but still be more or less not having to touch any buttons. Uh, so this is a super well or super quickly thrown together uh, just not do anything build. I don't have to touch a button. Um, you're using Illusion Axe, uh, you got Lower Armor, Endless Pain, some additional physical damage, Extractor, Area of Effect, Counter Attack with Center of Gravity, which you can put on anything, um, Blood Explosion with time or Damage Acceleration to help enemies die faster from the bleeds, uh, and then Thunderbolt, uh, which I just realized I didn't move the two things, so there, uh, Thunderbolt with the uh, Status Effect Enhancement, Continuous Shock, Element Damage Amp, Lightning Amp, uh, Area of Effect, uh, and using the Thunderbolt shoulders with it. Uh, Seal of Kinets Destruction just for some more oomph uh, and a move skill just because I threw it in. This is super sloppily thrown together in like a couple of minutes. Um, and we're going to go do a tier 10 map. Uh, so we'll do a 10 plus 1 just to show you uh, with no, no effort how much better this is. You saw earlier with me on a tier one map uh, with the reflect and this is this build on a 10 plus one and you can see that it is drastically better than reflect and I don't have an attack equipped I don't this is just passive I'm just running and doing damage uh, between the illusion axe and the thunderbolt um, and because I'm using uh, the Hamal uh, the physical's getting converted into the Thunderbolt, so the Thunderbolt's doing a ton of damage. Um, it's infinitely better already uh, than the Reflect will be at its absolute best. Um, so unfortunately, this, you know, really condemns Reflect. Uh, now, if you wanted to try to do a a build like this they do have their limits obviously just like any build it's not only gonna go so far um, I'm fairly well geared I don't have my charms and stuff set up super optimally on this character or anything um, but 
you see how I got through that quickly. Now we'll try on something uh, substantially higher. Let's try a 10 plus 20. And, uh, and we're just going to do a little bit to show that even though this is infinitely stronger than Reflect, it's not as strong as an actual build. Now, you could do uh, some optimization with this as well. Do I just realize, do I have, yeah, I do have one. Uh, so like 10 plus 20, you can still, you know, you can still avoid having an attack and push, uh, but there is limits. Um, obviously, it's significantly slower than an actual build would be. And, you know, it's sort of silly to try and do this. Now, you could try, I haven't done any testing with it. Maybe I'll do that for, for fun after this video. Um, with the Black Death or whatever. I'm sure this same setup with Black Plague or Black Death or whatever uh, could make this pretty powerful decently as well. You know what? I'm going to do that now. We'll just put it in this video. Let's see what that looks like. Uh, yeah. Okay. So now we have gone back real quick and thrown a copy of Black Plague in here. Uh, with some stuff on it. I didn't get too fancy. I'm not worried about trying to make this exact. Uh, but let's go do a map. I've never used this skill. Uh, but we're going to do a 10 plus 20. Uh, compare, just for comparison's sake against what we just did. Um, boom. Everything else is on. Okay, let's go. Yeah, it, I mean, it moves very well considering I don't have anything set up properly um, I think if you did this exact same build except put it together properly uh, it could be very very strong but there you go uh, reflect doesn't work uh, it's much easier to build yourself a build that just uses things that you don't have to press a button uh, or, you know, just build an actual build. Uh, it was just a fun project. I wanted to see what it's capable of. Um, but with, unfortunately, nothing to scale. And unable to actually see the values. Because when reflect damage happens to an enemy, a damage number doesn't show up. I can't even tell you if you can do it with double or triple damage or critical or anything. Um, so, at least for the foreseeable future reflect builds are not going to be viable anyways hope you enjoyed the video look forward to the next one and uh and stuff and thanks